A mocking hand hair is a wonderful story, the gift that keeps on giving. Colin Kaepernick, the Irish Colin Kaepernick, calls Independence Day a celebration of white supremacy. I agree. And by white supremacy, he means the greatest country on earth. European, uh, Europeans uh, created a civilization where uh, these people who complain about the greatest country on earth don't want to leave. <laughs> That's how, uh, that's how much white supremacy is in the country, <laughs> right? It's because black people have been dehumanized, brutalized, criminalized, and terrorized in the U.S. for centuries. Hmm. Uh, there was a stat I saw a few years back where, on, on average, black people kill more people per year than the entirety of the KKK. <laughs> I'm just, I forget what the, the number was. I think it was like 2,000. Or something, two thousand white people alone. Some outstanding number like that, and it's just like all you have to do is display that, um, display that everywhere. Anyway, I will make this too uh, long here. This is uh, Matthew right? Because we get where this is going. It's title, but he tells it all. All right. Anyway, Kaepernick issued a fierce rebuke of Independence Day. Of course, he did, slamming the celebration of white supremacy and uh, calling out America. For centuries of abuse against black people, sure. The star athlete, uh, okay, so let's just poke holes in Every Every civilization has quote unquote had abuse, okay? The only problem with a certain demographic is they cannot, they cannot get out of their own way, okay? They can't accomplish things. And it's, a, it's, it's most, okay, so here's the thing. It's it's most likely a cultural thing, but it's definitely an IQ thing. Okay, all the tests basically agree on these things. You know, all the um, all the the the, the all the used to be accepted um scientific um studies. Okay. And yeah, and they, they, there's 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 zero there's zero I've I've seen there's zero uh there's basically zero scientific what do you want to call it scientific stats out there that's uh, that's that says there's any racism no if anything racism goes the opposite direction okay that's it you know, I wouldn't get into much into these things <sighs> let's see anything else black people are highly criminalized no, it, it, you brutalize yourselves, you dehumanize yourselves, you, you criminalize yourselves, you terrorize yourselves. Okay. Alright, so let me end that there. Let me continue to another story. This is uh, because we live in the clown world. Home Depot removes spools of ropes from its shelves after the customer started making new <laughs> stores. Home Depot has switched to selling pre-cut ropes after June incident in North Carolina where a woman found two nooses in a Charlotte store. I won't be surprised if she did herself. Home Depot has removed spools of rope. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Recently last month. So we can't have, uh, we, can, we can't make nuts anymore. We cannot make nuts anymore. When these things, I mean, this is something like as a teenager I would just do just to mess with culture. This is called being funny. Of course, because we live in 2020, this is not humorous. This is serious. This is bad. This is oppression. This is racism. This is called humor, right? <laughs> okay. Okay. Th 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 this is this is this is funny stuff. Okay. If I see this, I'll start laughing. You know, the, the people who who don't laugh are probably a bunch of uh, leftist uh, retards who don't know comedy. If it bit them on the buttocks, okay. To to put that nicely. Uh, unfortunately, we've seen this is where spools are ripped to create hate symbols. Yes, hate symbol. <laughs> uh, there's probably like more white men hung by rope than there were black men just, just because of um, stats, you know what I mean? Like, because there's more white people, you know, it's yada yada yada. After the bond is a caution, we temporarily move spools of ropes around. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. What's going to happen? Uh, a white man is going to. Uh, Bring a uh, black man into Home Depot. Most likely, it'll be the opposite, <laughs> right? Honk, honk. 
most likely the opposite will be will happen and then when it does we we'll somehow miraculously there we won't see the race and anytime you don't see the race of uh, the criminal you pretty much get a hint who it is all right Smith no tell I don't know who Smith is probably somebody from uh, Home Depot anyway if customers are unable to find pre-cut ropes to link their specified calls they can ask an employee what and 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 dare uh, transmit COVID oh my goodness indeed racism is more hurtful than COVID oh my goodness the move comes a month after woman a month shopping at Home Depot a woman um, North Carolina says she came across a pair of news that was fashioned from a spool rope I was shocked Hattie Leonard uh, told WCNC of her disturbing discovery it's just one of those things you don't expect the store chain released a statement at the time addressing the incident in Charlotte the Home Depot does not tolerate racism yeah blah 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 corporate speak uh huh uh huh all right anyway. so this looks like a well written article um, really uh, really nice break up of sentences really nice paragraphs this is a professional who wrote this again Shaneja, oh boy, that's just shocking. Let me just see who Shaneja Fabrilov is. What is that, French? What is that? Uh, that's her, not too bad, not too bad. Alright, that's it. I'll leave that here. Uh, share, share, subscribe. So. To sum this up, there's racism around every corner, including Home Depot and people who tie nuts for, for any uh, purpose. Uh, you're a hateful racist and a bigot. And, um, uh, Kaepernick, yeah, July 4th is evil, and all these people who hate July 4th, hate America, somehow won't leave it because America is so evil. Go figure. Uh, I don't know. I'm not, uh, I'm not, I don't, I guess I don't possess the right type of logic. I guess that's going to be the future of people who claim they're um, philosophers and use logic and use math. It's They possess the wrong type of logic. That's why they can't see um, racism around every corner. All right, share, share, subscribe, thumbs up, bye.